Hi guys, it's Mike here. Welcome back to our channel. Today we're gonna to be reviewing this three-in-one shot timer from Pi. Me and Madel has been looking for a shot timer to improve our shooting experience. So we went with this one here, three-in-one shot timer from Pi. What they mean by three-in-one is a firearm, airsoft, and a stopwatch. We got this through Amazon, and you can get this to their website as well. So when you receive this, it comes in the hard cases. Let's open her up. We have a user manual. A USB cable this one here comes in built-in battery already on their website said it lasts about five days however I recommended you guys charge it before you head to gun range and the actual shot timer the shot timer design look like actual stopwatch There's a logo start, review and stop. This one will actually have an LED of green and this one will actually have a LED red. And this is your charging port. When you charge it, it there's an LED here will have red and it's when it, once it's fully charged, we'll actually have LED of blue, solid blue. And this one here is for RFID for airsaw, I'll explain about it more about it later on, but this is what will comes with. Let's go ahead and turn it turn it on. When you turn it on, it's nice white LED. So you have delay, split time, shot count, pause and start time. You have your mode sign, which is fire, and you have your battery indicator, and you have your lock and a different tone up to three, and you have your plus and minus here. So let's go ahead and scroll down to their menu. In order to go there, you have to hold this button down. So you have delay, par mode, mode, system. So let's go ahead and start with delay mode. So the delay mode, you have instant, random, fix, custom. So let's go ahead and click custom. So you have the delay one seconds or up to 10 seconds. So we're gonna leave it at one. So in order to select that, you have to just go back out and see that check mark right there. You have to hold this button down and there you have it. In order to go back, you just go back, press this uh, green button down now let's go to Parm. Uh, let's go back out, and you will see it will say custom one seconds, and let you guys hear that. And of course, S will flash. That means it's starting. In order to stop it, you just press that red button down. All right, let's go back to main menu, and let's show you guys par mode. In order to go to par mode, hold this button down. You have time. So you have one seconds, and this one will go up to 10 seconds of cycle. So we're gonna just leave it at one, go back out, go to cycle, hold that button down. This one here will let you cycle 10 cycle, but we're just gonna go ahead and try two cycles. So in order to select that again, go back out, go back out, and leave it there, and there's a check mark, so you hold this button down, Go back out, click that button down. Now you're in power mode. It will say indicator of power mode. So you guys will hear first beep, beep again to stop it, beep again to start, and beep again to stop. I'll let you guys hear that. All 
All right, let's go back to main menu. In order to get out the par mode, you have to hold this button down, which is the X mark, hold this button down, and there you have it. You're back on it again. So let's go to um, mode. In order to click the mode, you have this fire, airsoft, stopwatch. We're gonna leave it at uh, fire mode because we're mainly gonna use this for gun range mode. But let's show you guys around. In order to select that, you hold that button down. You have filter, hold that filter down. You have one up to 10 MS. Go back out and you have this sensitive and this one here goes up to eight. So go back out and it goes same thing as airsoft. And of course you have a stopwatch. In order to select either airsoft or stopwatch, you just hold this button down with the check mark and go back out. And now let's go to system mode. Hold the system mode and you have language. Default on this one is English, but I'm gonna show you guys. So you have Chinese and English, but we're just gonna leave it at that. And now we'll go back out and you have the echo mode. Echo mode is more their sleep time. If you guys not uh, using it, this one will actually go to sleep mode. So it reserve battery. So in order to select that, you hold this button down, you have normal. I'm not sure how long it's normal is, so, and you have this customize. So let's click the customize. So hey, you have 20 minutes. I got it set on 20 minutes, but this one can go up to 60 minutes. So I'm gonna leave it at 20 minutes. So if you don't use it at 20 minutes, this one here will just go to sleep mode to reserve the battery. And you have the RFID. RFID is more of airsoft uh, use only. So you have local, dot screen, and target. Go back out. And there you have it. Now, in order to go to the tone, there's three tone. You hold this button down, and you have this is number one. Number two, number three. Number one, number two, number three. I actually like number two, so I'm gonna leave it at that. And you have this uh, plus and minus sign. You can use it to go up and down too as well. But this one here is more of a airsoft user. So whenever you guys check their website, Go back out. Whenever you guys check their website, it does, uh, they do sell airsoft, like a target, a uh, whole bunch of target, and then you actually attach it to here. So every time you hit a target, it'll actually detect the time that you, when you hit it and actually show you the screen on it. So if you guys have time, go ahead and check out their website. It's pretty cool for airsoft user. The only thing I notice about this when we opening boxes here, this one here does not come with the belt loop like the rest of the shot timer out there. However, it does come with this little notch here to put a badge holder to connect with. Like I said, like a stopwatch design. But other than that, it's not bad at all. So just keep that in mind. Will not come a belt loop, but it will have this notch here. So make sure you guys have like a holder for it. But other than that, pie shot timer. Three in one. We're gonna take this one here. At the gun range and show you guys how it works. Once again, it's Mike. Thanks for watching our channel.